but so many years. So after that, again, God expressed His love is Jesus Christ. His, he sent to this world to save sinners. This is the God's love. So again, His Son, Jesus Christ, expressed His love on the cross. He, he shed His blood on the cross to save sinners. This is the great love expressed <coughs> for human beings. Second point is, I would like to tell you like the introduction. Second point is, man love for God. This is the great commandment, man love for God. Uh, in the Old Testament, Deuteronomy chapter number 6 verse 5 said, You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your mind. As well as in the New Testament, Matthew chapter number 22 verse 37 said, same words. Same words. So, we must love. Do you love God? Yes. Absolutely freaking hypocrite. <laughs> I will tell you. Many people tell, because our human being heart is full of deceit. We are not perfect. We can't say, I love God. <coughs> Yes, we love God. But we can say. We cannot say. Okay. God's love is never fair. God's love is never fair. In 1 Corinthians chapter number 13, verse 18. God's love never fair. It's very quick. Quick different from human love. God's love never fails. His love is real. Actually, I forgot to tell you my summer topic. My summer topic is <laughs> the love of God is real. <laughs> Sorry for that. The love of God is real. That's why very different human beings love and God's love. Here we go. Second, our third point. Third point is men love, men love for men. Men love for men. Do you love men? Do you love people? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Bible only said love to your friends, love to your neighbor. Uh, Jesus said in, uh, in John, Gospel John chapter 15, verse 12, 13 says, This is great commandment. Uh, this is this also commandment. Love one another as I have loved you. Greater love has no one than this, that someone lay down for his life, for his friend. This is the great thing. You have to express. You have to lay down the life for your friends. This is two types of lay down for your friends. Not in positive, uh, not in negative way. We have to lay down for positive. As Jesus Christ has done. Because Jesus Christ laid down his life for us. He shed his blood to save sinners. He laid down for us his life. Give us gift for us. Because of his blood, we got salvation. The Bible said, without the shedding of blood, there is no salvation. Because of Christ's love, he expressed, he saw his love on the cross by shedding his blood. We got salvation because of his love. So we have to lay down for your friends. We have to love your neighbor. Have you ever gossiped with your neighbor? Yes, we did. We did. Because we are human beings. But we have to love our neighbor. We have to love your friends. We have to love. There men love for men is the friends kind of love. We have love, dear love, husband and wife love. Parents, children love, their friends kinds of love. We have love, dear love, 
sisters you may love via that will never be forever. That will expire. That will be pass away one day. They will leave you. You will be alone one day. Brothers, you may have GM and you may have many love, many types of love, I will not explain. But they will leave you someday. That will not forever. But the love of God is remain. And then, husband and wife. Husband loves too much to his wife, but someday, husband will leave you alone. And wife loves to her husband too much. Too much. But one day, his husband, her husband will leave her alone. In this world, love is nothing. I mean, we have to love, we need love, but this is not eternal love. Once people pass away from this world, our love is away from this world, nothing. But the, God, but the love of God is real, that's why the love of God is always, whether you dead, even though you pass away from this world, after life also, the love of God is there. Yes. The love of God is all.